I'm now joined by Professor Ling Yangting from the Institute of Geology and Geophysics of Chinese Academy of Sciences. His lab is getting ready for the new lunar sample that will be brought back by Chang'e 5. It's very nice to talk to you, Professor Lin. If everything goes well, we are going to have some new lunar samples. Oh, I'm very excited to have a lunar sample. Before that, we have only the lunar meteorite. So that is the first time for Chinese scientists to have the lunar sample. As you know the reason, we cannot study on the lunar sample returned by Apollo mission. So how do you apply to access those new samples, and what are the procedures? Yeah, now the procedure is still is discussed, has not been fixed. The procedure will be announced on the website of the CNSA, the Chinese National uh, Space Administration. So we will apply for it. We will submit our application with a research proposal. So there will be a committee to screen your application and then make the decision if you'll get the, your sample or not. Well, Professor Lin, will those samples be shared with other countries? What are procedures? Yeah, I believe so because uh, uh, three, about three years ago, the Chinese uh, uh, Space uh, Administration contact with uh, ESA. So we both side, ESA and CNSA, discuss about how cooperate between the ESA, uh, European scientists, and with Chinese scientists working on the lunar sample. So we have, a dis we have discussed about this uh, for, for about many times. And uh, we are going to establish a joint scientist team. And uh, this team, We'll have uh, several working groups, so we're working together on the new lunar sample. Professor Lin Yangting from Chinese Academy of Sciences. Thank you very much, Professor Lin, for being with us today. Appreciate it.